hello guys so i am back for another product review or is this even a review so i'll just show you okay these things right here are books that i placed on my table this i purchased this for just table decoration and it so happened that i also love the content so i will show you what's inside because if you are a shopper that just don't want to buy book because of the cover but as well as wants to enjoy the enjoy reading the content of it or seeing pictures and get inspired then yes this video is for you and keep on watching because i'm gonna show you as many pages as i can and let's get into it okay so we've got here the first book Ah, it's here <laughs> so here we go we have the cover really pretty um this one right here though is like a metallic brown which i really don't like so when you put it on your desk it's gonna be like that metallic brown and i don't like the text i don't like this it's just i don't like it but other than that everything is pretty right up my alley there you go back you get the barcode right there top sides i don't like it <laughs> so first page there you go this one right here is more on like earthy kind of vibes like woods i'm not seeing any marbles you know there you go see that <laughs> it's a chopping board that it's just for display and then you got this wooden baby right here that looks like so scary it shows their contents so here it's introduction the natural elements and natural homes simply natural shades of gray and there you go acknowledgements this book is really heavy this one right here so basically this video is just showing you what's the content of this book okay to guide you whether this art or design is for you so if you're more on a modern side kind of person or if your taste is more modern then you might not like this so get another book plants and foliage so it shows plants we've got here um nice frames i really want to get a big frames so right behind this one right here is a frame i got it from studio mcgee <laughs> and uh it looks really pretty but it's just too commercialized and it's really affordable let's just say cheap but i like it i wish it's a bit bigger though there you go let's proceed you okay, guys so you'll see here different kinds of pots and plants so since this is nature elements so you'll have here the um pot clay pots uh tin it's like a can a wood and yeah it's pretty ferns this one right here you got a glass so green I'm having a hard time. There you go. There you go, guys. Give this video a thumbs up and a subscribe if you like this kind of videos. There you go. Um, well, when you when you think about glass, this also belongs to a modern, like a modern kind of style. But yeah, you can mix and match, you know. Uh, my style is mix and match guys uh, there are times i um i have this wild side of me that i want a colorful painting like a statement but um i i rethink every time i considered getting one because what if it's not gonna fit what if i bought a very expensive um poster big poster but um in a few months later then i wouldn't like it so that's why so I choose what I buy and carefully. 
unless it's really affordable then whatever i can waste money and showing your paints um i don't know why they're showing eggs here <laughs> peeling paint we don't want that right <laughs> there you go fabrics fabrics that uh under natural elements i guess i don't know what i'm talking there you go what else fabrics so i really like this kind of fabric right here for our kitchen it's like a starch fabric like cornstarch sack but i couldn't find it you know there's like one in target but i just don't like the the fr fringes like the corners of it it's just it looks i don't know it doesn't look high-end speaking of sack <laughs> fabrics this kind of fabrics these ones right here are my favorite so you now you know why i bought this though it was a lock that i got i got a book that i also did like the interior because when i purchased this i checked reviews and they didn't show um a lot of pictures they just show the cover because people rotten nowadays they just focus on the cover but not the interior or the content of the book but this one right here is all in one package look at this painting is so big so, this one i like this hmm. i like what i'm seeing there you go I'm just gonna skip okay at least you have the idea what would you expect in this um book natural stone floor kind of rough you got this one right here look at that bed Ooh, I like it i still like white white walls though our walls are kind of yellowish undertone and not really my favorite because it's dark sometimes it translates well on the camera but i like it when the house is bright brighter than what we have now because sometimes when i film it's just a yellow color it's just too much but let's go back to this and uh, what else there you go this table though i like a wood table and chair for dining uh you know like dining tables it's just we don't have space in here look at this i love this pot, pot. soon i'm gonna get a real plant oh look at that linen this one i don't know where i can get these i just don't look and if i see one probably it's gonna be expensive it's because it's in you know people is people want it so if it's very in demand then it's gonna be expensive look at this gallery right here it's a lot there you go mm. this pot is pretty gorgeous gorgeous and there's the dog my dog i wish that painting is unique um there you go uh well this is too much of a nature kind of interior look at that um i don't know it's just too too earthy for me <laughs> and that's the last one right there so yeah that's the content of this book right here the natural home <laughs> now let's proceed to the second book second one is 
side is the same metallic brown gold i don't know nomad at home hillary but this one right here looks better than the first one because um is it look does it look better they look the same though this one is just i don't know why just make them just plain a little bit of bold and the name of the ones that made this book that's it we don't need too much you know but whatever maybe i should make my own book tour so this is the cover right here it's pretty forward by leon ford pretty design designing the home more traveled there you go back okay let's start <laughs> So this one right here is for travelers, you know, if you don't travel and you just want to get an idea of um, interior everywhere around the globe, I guess you can find it in this book right here. Just an inspiration, you know, right, you can go. So sometimes, like I've, that, like I've said earlier, like sometimes I have this um, weird style, like I want a big painting or posters that has a lot of colors sometimes i'm influenced with some youtubers like they have this big statement like colorful it's just it pops up it pops up or pops out because it's just too too big and massive and different color <laughs> i know earthy it's a bit similar to the, the first book I've shown you but it has this book has more colors introduced unlike the other one it's more on natural elements like earthy brown cream white you know this is like Morocco style I don't know I've never been there though I've seen some videos pictures look at those pots this one i like i very very like <laughs> but not the peeled walls <laughs> not my favorite i like it more neat the peeled walls uh-huh uh-uh uh, uh. looks nice um they're they're nice to appreciate from afar but i don't want to own a house that has walls that are peeling you know? not me so we've got here a table that's that looks earthy and overused but like i've said they've introduced a twist like colors looks pretty How about that? Okay, enough of talking. Oh, mortar, right? This is called mortar, right? I've had this. I have one of it. I ordered it in Amazon, I think. But when it arrived, I thought it's small, but it's pretty gigantic. So what we're doing with it is we just put it in our counter. And um, sometimes I... I used to um, smash my ginger to make ginger tea or just put fruits on it, like fruit display. Having a hard time. Ooh, so this one involves the marbles. Is that marbles? Oh my God, the words just, it, I can't remember. I'm just tired. Go. This one is pretty. I don't know about the others. This one is okay too. So what's with the pots? I like them. I wish you could put water in them though, but you can't. It's gonna <clears throat> it's gonna leak. Make it faster. Let's make it faster. Let me adjust the camera showing oh. 
I'll just skip guys, okay? This looks very refreshing. Ooh, I like that. I like that color. You know, I like it when my house has this kind of um, wood stain and but majority of the walls are white. I'm just weird, like very contrast, like very opposite color, but I just like it like that. I like color white walls. My husband would tell me it looks, it's gonna feel like hospital, girl. I said, no way, I don't care. The Wanderers, right? Wanderers. There go. Pretty. My biggest dream, actually, guys, is to own a house. If not here in the U.S., then in the Philippines. So when I, when it's time to slow down, you know, time to retire or time to, yeah, retire or just rest, <laughs> then I have a house to go home or to to live in. You know, in the Philippines, I I really wanna. I really want to stay longer there and then just go back and forth travel from here to the Philippines, Philippines to here. Look at that stool, it's pretty. It's so cute. Cabin style. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Let me just stand because my hand hurts. <laughs> go. Because, you know, I need help. Hmm, it's nice over there. I wish I have a garden. Get you closer, darling. No, let's open this. No, it's not. <laughs> I'll skip, okay? Go. I don't like it. This one? It's too much. I don't like I know, white walls with yellow undertone. I just don't like it. I don't know why. It's just... It's too much. Maybe one room is fine. Maybe bedroom but i want my like living room or kitchen to be a white pure white so i can um, buy stuff that are like earthy like black you know it's like a canvas i want a white canvas i'm sk skipping some page okay so this is the cover page i believe there you go Chic empty I feel like this kind of style is it's not in anymore but don't get me wrong it's just for me I don't like it because there's too many um I've seen like printable like printable images that everybody owns so yeah that's not my favorite see the white walls Ooh, white walls with stained woods looks pretty like it clean because the good thing about white walls you can introduce a lot of colors and it will still looks tidy <laughs> so weird <laughs> there you go i'm gonna skip huh because i'm starting to get tired <laughs> Go. Ooh, gold sometimes i just want to introduce gold there are a lot of um items like mirror frames that are gold but i'm too scared to get them because um some of our majority of our stuff here is colored black white and some silvers so if i introduce gold it's like too many colors already look at that <laughs> Who's gonna use that? It's an it's an ice tray. But well, it's wood. I think that's only good for display. 
and there you go big statements and i'm gonna skip to the last part because we are done hmm. there you go guys so hmm so there you have it guys um these are the two books that are worth checking and uh, if you're eyeing on this hope the video helped you decide whether these are worth purchasing i believe these books are not really expensive so if you're just up for home decor like look at these are very gorgeous um covers but if you also care about the content then if you're more on earthy earthy kind of interior designing then you might get a, an inspiration see you on my next post guys and thanks for watching just don't forget to click the like button and um, yes and if you want to subscribe then please do subscribe and see you on my next post bye